morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome on this new video on Absolver 25th of September. Just like that, just like that. Uh, at the beginning of the video. Now you can click away if you want. Oh, please don't. Please don't. <laughs> Stay with me, guys. Tell me like a hell cat. So, here we are. This is just a quick one uh, to tell you a couple of things. Uh, it's been uh, uploaded by Sony. A new post, uh, which the link is going to be in the description, as always. Uh, which says uh, the exact release date for the update everybody was waiting for. The downfall um, Absolver update. And looks like the Christmas for us comes three months in advance because it's gonna be on the 21st, 25th, 25th. Why I have so many problems to say 25th? 25th of September, everybody! Yay! And on the post uh, on the PlayStation blog that they have made, uh, there's a lots of information that we're gonna go through, guys, right now. Uh, I'm not gonna show the post for copyright reasons but again the link is gonna be in the description so first thing first uh, as you may know the update is gonna have PvE and PvP content PvE is gonna be of course the downfall expansion with all of the adult mines and the three new bosses DLC and the PvP content is gonna be literally everything else that's in the DLC as you may know, or maybe don't know, we're gonna have a new mode in the game that is being called the Downfall Game Mode, in which we're gonna go into the mines of Adal, and we're gonna try to defeat uh, the main boss, uh, which is called Arcel, and is Infected Prospects. Each run is gonna be unique, uh, because it's gonna be a procedurally generated dungeon, and in these dungeons, by killing the, the enemies that are there, we're gonna get uh, Gleam or Glem or Gleam. <laughs> that um, is gonna be like a new, a new sort of uh, currency that will give you uh, sort of some sort of rewards at the end of the dungeon. And you can also use it to buy new outfits into the essence shop. Yay! Uh, in the dungeons, there's gonna be a lot, a ton of you new enemies and new equipments, and also there's gonna be three new boss fights, which we can uh, have a um, brief uh, tease on this um, picture here. You can see clearly the the player in the middle, and there's like these three guys around him. Now, one of them is clearly the main boss of the DLC. Uh, which you should be already familiar with but there are like these two other guys there there's one here on the right which is like flying away so it's not that clear to be seen but the other one on this side looks like to be a female opponent and he has a hood a mask with a hood so maybe I'm gonna change my mask who knows then we also have this picture here uh, that looks like to be a normal completely normal picture but if you look closely you can see that in the background there are uh, again that red hood uh, lady uh, presumably one of the bosses and this like this other guy which I'm very sure they put it there in that like weird pose just to you know to give us something to speculate about but it's not gonna be anything special for me this guy is like another player with like a new mask that we're gonna find uh, and, and nothing more <laughs> um, and finally if we look at the last picture there is gonna be the main picture of the DLC we can see like this three absolver in the front cover now uh, the one in the center and the one in the right uh, they are like we already know the equipment apart from uh, the mask that the one the, this guy on the right is wearing but the other lady the one in, in the left uh, all of our equipment is kind of new, like we, we never see uh, those uh, clothes before. So yeah, that looks pretty dope, uh, and ex especially the mask, I love hooded mask. And it, I think this mask is the same uh, that is showed in the other picture, uh, like the one for the, the boss 
the third like lady boss, you know, the one I showed you before. Uh, but who knows? It could be something different. It looks it looks very the same, to be honest. Just changing color. But again, who knows? Also, as you may know, or as you maybe don't know, <laughs> uh, we're gonna get a new style with more than 24 new moves. Actually, they say they mention uh, like three dozens of moves, which means it's gonna be like 36 moves. But I, I really like the 24 as a number, so I, I wanted to say 24. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, we're gonna get new moves for. Um, uh, Bare hands combat, uh, gloves combat, and sword combat, along with the new style, which is based off of Jet Li, uh, Jet Kondo style of fighting, and is is um, suggested to only to experience observer. So it's something that you want to go uh, through after you already know the game. It's not something you want to start with because it's gonna be like a more complex style to use. I'm very curious uh, what this thing is gonna be because they talk about uh, different instances. You know, like if you are like in front stance, you're gonna be aggressive and if you are in like back stance, you're gonna be defensive. 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 So this thing really make me curious and it's something that I definitely gonna check it out when it comes out um, Like probably everybody, <laughs> but yeah, I am not I, I'm planning to stay stagger uh, Anyway, but who knows maybe I really like that one uh, new style and I'm gonna change permanently We, we don't know we don't I don't know yet on the PvP front, we're gonna have new uh, school challenges mode that uh, will, you know, that when you go PvP, you can. I, I didn't understand actually if you gonna go always uh, PvP school, if you have a school, or you can choose. But when we go PvP, either if they give us the choice to, to go like normal PvP or school PvP, uh, we can have the chance to. Um, fight for our school which is amazing it's something that i really wanted like school versus school is something that i tried to do on the channel not we haven't been like that successful uh, unfortunately uh, but we tried we tried and it was like a cool idea and i'm i'm glad they implemented it and uh, basically what we're gonna do is you you fight for your school so you you get like school points at the end of the fight and whatever school has the most school points at the end of the season uh, it's gonna be there's gonna be a prize for them and it's gonna be for the three the first three schools So there's like three prizes every season for the best three schools as mentioned before We're gonna have a lot of new equipments and new masks and they talked about new powers as well like two or three I don't remember and new PvP intros and new weapons and personally I, it's still a dream. I know it's probably not gonna happen, but uh, please please slow clap. Give me the stuff Give me the stuff. I I I want to fight with the stuff I, I, I want it, please So that's it for today. Oh this <laughs> the camera. That's it for today Thank you very much for watching the videos guys Leave a like down below if you enjoyed it subscribe for more because they are coming Don't forget to join the discord guys because when the DLC drops on the 25th We are gonna go together like me and the guys from the discord into the DLC and we're gonna kick These new bosses for good So definitely join the discord if you haven't already the link is in the description uh, Link in the description even for the full article about the DLC update, uh, check it out. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Feel the rain. What?